Well, during the ninth annual Elders Gathering in Seven Clans Casino in Red Lake, elders learned about new projects and services being offered in Red Lake. Lakeland News reporter Malak Katab tells us what went on during the first day of the event. Tribes from all over Minnesota and around the country gathered at the casino in Red Lake to take part in this year's elders' gathering. The gathering started with a breakfast, an open ceremony, and a flag ceremony. The MC for the event, Gary Jordan Jr., says that it's great to see all the elders in one place because most of them don't go out a lot. A lot of them really don't go a lot of places, you know, um, so when this, event, when this event happens, it brings them out, and it, it's really great to see them all together, and all the knowledge that's in, that's in that room is, is just amazing. The event is put on every year to keep the elders in the community informed on new projects and services being offered by tribal program directors. With all the information booths, um, just to let them know that there, there are services out there for them, and um, that the Red Lake Nation is here to, to, uh, to help them out in any way that we can. There are around 20 information booths inside the Seven Clans Casino for the gathering of the elders, and one growing issue in the community is Alzheimer's. As we live longer as Indian people, most likely we're going to see more, um, and that's a concern, you know, of, of us, and we want to help educate people on, better ta on taking better care of themselves now, hopefully as a preventive measure against dementia later in life. And also a warning for the younger people because we know that there is, seems to be an increase in younger onset too of dementia. The Northwoods Caregiver Dementia Outreach Specialist says that dementia in Native American elders is being looked into closely because indigenous people in the past haven't lived as long as other people from different cultures. Other informational booths included family and children services, senior companion programs, housing initiatives, public safety, and even instructions on how to obtain medical insurance. Most of these services are offered around Red Lake and are put in place to help the elders. Reporting in Red Lake, Malak Katab, Lakeland News. The event will continue tomorrow at the Seven Clans Casino starting at 8 in the morning. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.